Caitlin, thank you. Well, the Omaha Community Foundation has given out $225,000 in grant funding to 19 black organizations right here in Omaha. Yeah, I talked to the leaders of two of them to find out about how they're continuing to leave a positive impact. My name is Naomi and I attend... Whether it's twisting braids or shaping up a fade, the art of styling hair is a valuable skill for barber Jermaine Bell. So valuable, he wants to make sure the new generation has the opportunity to learn how to do it. That's the majority of what his nonprofit, All in the Family Mentoring and Support, does. Promoting a career path that doesn't necessarily involve a college education. Everybody's not meant to go to college. And everybody doesn't have the, the resources or anything like that to go to college. They just honestly, they really, they don't. And it's a lot of kids who are looking to do something, but they just don't know what. Over $10,000 in grant funding will go to keep the nonprofit's beauty camps up and running. It'll also go to their backpack giveaway, providing free school supplies for families in need once school starts this August. Each year, the Omaha Community Foundation gives out thousands in funding to black organizations from its African American Unity Fund. Another recipient this year, A Mother's Love, it supports women who are pregnant. Their help goes beyond basic needs like food and clothes. Just being there during postpartum and um, just uh, being able to support them with support groups or talking to them, going to their doctor's visits. They'll use the grant money to fix up their pregnancy wellness space. We wanted to have that so moms can have a space and be able to have a uh, culture spe spe culturally specific area to come to to be able to feel themselves and be able to ask questions that they might not be able to ask anywhere else or be able to release some things that they might not be able to release. They say many moms to be, especially those of color, face tougher, more stressful pregnancies because of many socioeconomic factors. They hope the work they're able to do can save lives. I've had clients that have died and now we've had babies that have died and so we feel the impact also as a community. We feel that impact so we want to be able to make um, an impact and just help them be successful with, yeah, everyone, with their pregnancy, birth, Life. and their postpartum care. Mm -hmm.